Hey, what's up? This is Scott with Level Up Tuts, and today we're going to be talking about a loyalty program within PrestaShop. Now, PrestaShop includes a module that is built by PrestaShop, but not included in your default installation. And we can enable this module and start a loyalty program that's easy to use and easy to set up. So check it out. We're going to get into that right now. So let's say we want to set up a loyalty program for our customers so that they can take advantage of discounts and things like that. What we want to do is we want to come to the modules page and then under the search bar here we can just start typing in loyalty and you'll notice that there is a loyalty program module already created by PrestaShop itself and you can just install it nice and easy with this install button. Once that's complete, it's going to take you into the settings itself where you'll see that we have things like uh, a ratio. And what the ratio really is, is that for every $10 right now, you're getting one reward point. So every $10 that any of your customers spend in your store, they get one reward point. And every single reward point is equal to 20 cents. So that way they can get a discount of 20 cents uh, for every $10 that they spend in your store. Now these values, because they're present here in this form can be modified in any sort of way. Let's say you think this might be a little, uh, you know, they you don't want them to get points every 10. You want them to get points every $50 they spend, but you want points to be worth more. Let's say points are going to be worth uh, like $5 off. So every $50 they spend, they get $5 off. So that discount is bigger, but they don't have to, uh, or they have to spend more to get it. Okay. Now you can have the validity period of a point. Let's say they order one thing and then maybe a year later come back and order something else. You want to determine whether or not uh, those points expire. By entering zero here, those points are not expiring. Okay, now the voucher details is really just a label. So loyalty reward works for me, so we can keep that. And then the minimum amount in which the voucher can be used. With zero dollars, that means you can use this voucher on anything. Uh, technically, if they had a $5 voucher and were purchasing for something for $5, they could get it for free. If you wanted to prevent them from doing anything like that, you could say, well, they need to buy $10 or more first. Uh, I'm gonna leave this at zero for now. And then we can apply taxes on the voucher or not. We'll leave that at no. And points are awarded when the order is delivered. When the uh, And the points are canceled when the order is canceled. If you set this to delivered, that prevents uh, a customer from maybe ordering something and then canceling it and still getting those points. Now, you could also have it set to be shipped or pretty much any of these things for them to get those reward uh, loyalty points. Okay, now we can offer, uh, we can say, can they get discount points? Uh, we can say if they can get points on discounted products or not, we can say the points can be gathered in the following categories. And as you can see, we also have this loyalty points progression so that this is what your customers are going to see when they're checking on their loyalty points. Uh, if it's awaiting validation, unavailable on discounts, uh, available, canceled, all this good stuff. And so as you can see here, we have the potential to build a really nice loyalty and rewards program with very little configuration. In fact, this is just really fantastic. Everything's labeled really well. And just by simply enabling this and then saving, you have now started this Royal uh, rewards program and the rewards are going to be connected to your customers accounts. Now, as you can see here, I've loaded up my cart with this woman's blouse. It's uh, $25. We have six of them. So I'm going to click pay by check because I don't actually want to pay anything for this. And we're going to confirm my order. And after this, let's check out my account settings. Okay, so this is telling me all about the pay by check. Great. So let's come to my account now. And we can now see that we have this My Loyalty Points tab here under your account settings. So if we click on this, you can see that we have uh, this pending uh, loyalty points, right? So from my order that included this blouse, which was made just now, uh, 
it has three points pending and it's awaiting validation. Now this point status is going to change once the order has been shipped and delivered, and then I will have three points ready to use, which is the equivalent of $10, I mean the equivalent of $15 off my order. So you've now set up a loyalty rewards program and it couldn't have been easier. As always, this is Scott with Level Up Tuts. If you have any questions or comments, leave a comment in the video or hit us up at Facebook or Twitter. We love to hear from you. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.